Good afternoon. Welcome to Jim Monday's World of Weather. Clicked on to the orange weather forecast discussion for August 29th through September 10th. August 29th through September 2nd. We, uh, the, pork, uh, the pattern is forecast to be um, amplified. We have a, a trough here over Alaska, the Gulf of Alaska, and in the east. And here's the identity of um, Harvey showing a weakness here. And we have a ridge, very strong ridge, over the western states centered over the northwest. The models are good agreement with this. We go through the models. And we see very little change in the overall circulation. And speaking of Harvey, Harvey is in a weak stern current across the southern plains in the Gulf of Mexico. This will cause the effects of Harvey to linger through this period. Heavy rainfall is forecast in the path of the system, especially across southeast Texas, resulting in catastrophic flooding. And here's the um, flood, uh, the rainfall amounts that are forecast here. You can see we're in like the deep purple. Uh, this would be 20 inches or more. This is probably understate, understated. It'll probably be more like 30 inches or more. Now, um, to take a look at the models, this is a GFS. And you can see, oh, you can't see it yet. We'll bring it in. I'll have to exp expand this. Here's Harvey here, and this is a 20 to go through the 30th. It kind of meanders, still has an identity of closed circulation. And here's a GFS, which holds onto it a little bit longer, pretty much the same, but it kind of lingers here across this area here. You can see the heavy rainfall of, of maybe one to two inches that the GFS is forecasting. This is for next Friday. Other areas of precipitation across the south and this will be the south and southeast of the lower mid-Atlantic. Scattered, convic uh, scattered convection will be across the higher elevations of the west. And temperatures will remain above normal in the west with anomalies at 10 degrees or more above normal. And temperatures be below normal across the southern plains and the lower Mississippi Valley due to the effects of Harvey with the clouds and the precipitation. We're going to look now at the period for September 1st to the 5th. Here we are at the 1st. The pattern remains amplified, doesn't change very much. You can still see that GFS still has the effects here of Harvey right here. We have a trough over the Gulf of Alaska in the east and a strong ridge here over the west and we take a look at the rest of the models they're in good agreement on this circulation for this period and then we go through the days we don't see the pattern change very much we come to the fifth and you can still see there's a weakness here of harvey So during this forecast period, I am forecasting above normal temperatures for this area here with anomalies of two to eight degrees below normal, the lower anomalies here, and above normal temp uh, below normal temperatures for portions of the Southern Plains, Lower Mississippi Valley, and the Northeast with anomalies of two to four degrees below normal and for precipitation calling for below normal precipitation here, above normal precipitation, especially across this area due to Harvey, and into the Mid-Atlantic region. For September 6th to the 10th, we go to the 6th, the pattern becomes much more amplified than compared to the previous period. So I'll have our Still have our trough here over the Gulf of Alaska and Alaska. Still, the GFS still shows a little bit, of, still shows the effects of Harvey, but this is an outlier, but it still could be lingering here during this period. And we have a trough here in the east, and we have a strong ridge in the west. And we look at the rest of the models, 
the this is the uh, what is this one European ensembles still also showing a little slight weakness here due to Harvey and then we look at the Canadian still a weakness and then we go to the end of the period GFS then we look at the European very strong ridge here in the west western North America strong trough here in the east and the, the models are good agreement during this period so for this forecast I'm calling for uh, above normal temperatures here for the western states with the normal is eight degrees or more above normal especially across the northwest below normal temperatures are forecast here with the normal is four degrees below normal and for precipitation Below normal precipitation forecast here. Above normal precipitation forecast portions of the Southern Plains, Lower Miss Valley, Florida, and Northern New England. So that's long range weather forecast discussion for August 29th through September 10th. Thanks for coming to Jim Mullins World of Weather and have a good day.